This is the Juki Post Machine. It is double needle or single needle. There are two volumes, one on each side, one on each side. You can thread it for one or two threads, and the threading is exactly the same as the Nakajima cylinder machine. Stitch length is here. Reverse, pull down and hold. This is a knee lift down here, and then foot pedal just like all the other industrial machines, make sure that you turn the power on and off when you're done. So to thread the machine, each thread goes through the hole inside the first tension wheel. So you can see that the two threads go in different directions around the top two tension wheels. The one in the back, which will be the left needle thread, goes around the top of the tension wheel, underneath the post, up and around to the left of the second tension wheel, and then down around to the right and underneath the wire. The other one is going also around the top of the first tension wheel, but you see where it is with the post. It goes over the post instead of under, and then around to the right and under the tension wheel, and again, under the tension wheel and up into the wire. And you want to make sure that you get all of that in the back channel of each one. Up through the thread guard, up through the uptake, which is two holes, down, down through another thread guard, down through two holes in the top of the needle, and then it threads each needle from the inside going out and the easiest way to do it is to lift the foot, drop the needles all the way down past the foot and you'll see then the needles are clear and you can actually thread them and you can get at them. This machine also has two uh, bobbins, one on each side, which are threaded in opposite directions one on each side, and then they have to be manually loaded from the bottom. The bobbins load in opposite directions. So the one on the right, the thread goes clockwise and goes through the um, metal part and under the triangle, just like it does on all the other industrial machines. The one on the left is the opposite. So it goes counterclockwise and then up through the slot under the triangle which is now at the top and then when you load the bobbin take the needle both needles take one complete stitch and then pull the bobbin threads up so that everything goes